All right, man, what is this? What are you doing to us? Stop it! What's your name, miss? Justine. Well, Justine, I love you. I love you, I too. love all of you. All right? And I don't care what you've done. God hates the sin, but he loves the sinner. Mm. Example, Sandra. Who is Sandra? Where is I? All right. Now, Sandra, it, it says here that you want to kill a coworker named Carol. Yeah. Oh, oh, Sandra, I understand. When I'm frustrated, I want to wring someone's neck. Exactly. Ring it hard. So what do you do? What do you do when that feeling comes over you? Well, I put on a hoodie that covers my face, and I take the 47 bus line to a library in a faraway town. Then I open a private browser on one of their computers and Google how I'm thinking of killing her to see what mistakes people usually make. Jesus. Today is a high alert day. I can't stress enough the importance of being vigilant and cautious in light of the serious threats we'll be facing. Dina's right, so everybody keep an eye out for anything out of the ordinary, okay? Good. Let's watch out for people buying toilet paper, eggs, shaving cream, ketchup, your squeezables, your squirtables. Everything is a weapon today, okay? What about guns? Those are fine. Incidentally, that costume is ridiculous. Professor X doesn't drink martinis. Yes, but James Bond does. <sighs> oh, come on, Dina. Stop being the Halloween version of Scrooge, whatever that is. Oh! Booge! Boo! Scrooge! I just thought of that. Yeah, don't be such a booge. Put on a costume. Get yeah, 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 yeah. Don't be a boo. Peer pressure Boos. from a group of people I don't respect. Now that's scary. I mean, I can't believe I'm saying this, but Sandra's the only other grown up here. Actually, I am dressed up. I'm you. Shut up, Sandra. Oh, shut up, Sandra! <laughs> oh my god, that's so cool. You're gonna be twinsies. No, we're not. Wait, you guys should stand together all day. I'm up for it. Yeah, I'm gonna find a costume to put on. Excuse me. Can I? Excuse me, sir. Yeah. Sir, this lady here. She... When you have a second. Sir. <laughs> Thanks for trying. <laughs> You're welcome. If you want to sit here while you wait, you can. Okay. I'll sit. <laughs> when he confronted the witches, it really grounded him. Exactly. <laughs> Does your husband or boyfriend like Vampire Diaries as much as you do? Oh, I'm not seeing anyone. What about Jeff? Who's Jeff? Her serious boyfriend. <laughs> oh, right. I do have a boyfriend. Sorry. Excuse me. Hi. Carol. Amy is not my soulmate, okay? Yes, fine. When I first started working here years ago, I had a little crush on Amy there. I said it, okay? Are you happy? Exactly. And at one point, I had a crush on Jonah, and that's all in the past. Exactly. Wait, what? You, when did you? You, yeah, no, never mind. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Because if even if we, because it, with the timing and everything, it's, yeah, so you get it. So stop. <laughs> he didn't know. Do you still love each other? What? No, we never, that, we've moved on. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. And, you know, and you, you, anyway, it, it, it doesn't matter. We, we've all, you know, and, and and besides, you know, I've <laughs> I'm with I've got I'm with um Kelly. With Kelly, yeah, no, I I, I know your name, obviously. Guys, this is amazing. Yeah, yeah I'm it. generally a cynic, but this wow. She didn't know that he didn't know. And now he knows that she knows We get it, Sandra.
Barbarian's Gate 3 is being released today, so I need everybody on their A-game, as this store is going to be packed with video game nerds, and we don't want to risk a trampling. Well, we're never going to totally prevent tramplings. Oh, no, obviously, we're never going to have zero tramplings, but we can have fewer tramplings. Um, can I set one of the video games aside before we sell out? Amy, employees can't reserve merchandise. You know this. You're into video games? After a long day of work, it's nice to have a glass of wine and reach into a stable boy's chest and pull out his still-beating heart. Oh, feed the birds, feed <laughs> the birds. I just don't get how murdering people is considered fun. I mean, what happened to all those innocent games? You know, like Frogger and Qbert and Donkey Kong? Innocent? Qbert's about a big-nosed, creepy little freak that commits suicide when things get hard. Frogger's basically a frog holocaust. I remember a glitch in the original Donkey Kong where it looks like the ape has a penis. Sometimes when I'm playing The Sims, I give myself a family. Jesus Christ. So, uh, welcome back, Carol. Uh, we're all so thrilled to see how well you're doing. Thanks. I'm so ready for a fresh start. Me too. Me too. But just asking, corporate knows what she did at my wedding? Yep. They uh, offered her a store transfer, <laughs> but uh, lucky for us, she declined. Like, I'm going to leave this store. You guys are like family to me. Yeah, so, so sweet. Um, well, Carol, before we can get you out on the floor mm -hmm. again, I've just been asked to get a quick apology. Okay, great. Oh, you think I should apologize? Well, I mean, you almost made me kill your cat. I did that? You stole Jerry from me. You rubbed your wedding in my face for months, and then you asked me to be your maid of honor. I mean, that was just cruel. You told me I had to. I don't know, Amy. It seems like she's not ready to take responsibility. You know, Carol, mm -hmm. uh, some people might think actually that um, you are the one who should apologize. Oh, oh, I see. Um, the thing is, when I spoke with CJ DeBono at HR, he said that my manager should be impartial. And CJ DeBono would know. I mean, mm -hmm. he's... He's CJ DeBono. He said I should call if there were any hiccups or... Yeah, no, no, I don't I don't think we need to call CJ DeBono. Mm. I, we can handle this internally. Um, I just need a, a quick apology. Sorry. I heard an apology. Great, let's get back to work. Please! Ah! 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 